Hello children Today we will know about division method First of all if you are new on this channel please do like share and subscribe the channel and press the bell icon so that you will get the notification of the new videos coming soon We have already learned about basic division in a previous video If you haven't watched that video then do watch it as it will help you to understand the concept of the division better the link of that video is given in the description below now let's learn something new about division in the first and second part we learned what is division and the properties of the division okay in this video we will learn how to do division okay children as you all know here 7 is divisor 15 is quotient and 110 is dividend and 5 is remainder i hope you must know this very well division can be written in three ways you can see on the screen now moving on There are five steps to simple division. Let's see these steps while finding the quotient. For example, 97 divided by 2. Step 1, compare the digit. Here in 97, we compare the leftmost digit of the dividend is 9 with the divisor 2. Here nine is greater than the divisor two. It means we can divide it. Now moving on to the step two, divide. Here as the divisor is two, we use the table of two to find product which is equal to or less than and nearest to the digit of the dividend. Let's find the number of 9 in table of 2. Children, is there number 9 in the table of 2? No. What will do? We will find a number that is equal to or less than and nearest to the digit of the dividend 9. Yes. Here we got it. It is less than nine and nearest to the nine. So we will write four as a quotient. Now move on to the step three, multiply. As two fours are eight, and we will write the number eight in the tens column under nine. Now moving to the step four, subtract. Let's subtract eight from nine. Nine minus eight is equal to one. Now let's move on to the step five. Bring down the next digit. Children, let's bring down the next digit of ninety-seven. Let's bring down the seven. Yes. So we have number seventeen over here. So we can divide it seventeen by two. Now again we apply the same step one to five. Let's again we use the table of two to find the product which is equal to or less than. And nearest to the digit of the dividend. Here, dividend is seventeen. Yes, here we got it. Two, eight, just sixteen. So we will write eight as the quotient above seven. As two, eight, just sixteen, and we will write the number sixteen under seventeen. Now we subtract sixteen from seventeen. Then remainder will be seventeen minus sixteen is equal to one. 
Now we have finished all division. Kids, here two is divisor, forty-eight is quotient, and ninety-seven is dividend, and one is remainder. All we have to do is use to the following relation. Dividend is equal to quotient into divisor plus remainder. That is, quotient is forty-eight, divisor is two, and remainder is one, which is equal to ninety-six plus one. Is equal to ninety-seven. Children, did you notice our dividend is ninety-seven? I hope you have understood today's video very well.